inventory lanes. Yeah, I, man, look, I hurry up and got down here. I got the message, 911. Yeah, look, they say 911, I say, man, it must be a real emergency going on over there with Tori. What's going on, man? How did you think this was going to go? You thought that this was going to be an easy ride, something easy to transition into? You thought you was going to be able to walk around and wear nice jackets like this? What did you think was going to happen? You thought that you were... You're not going to get no special treatments in here, Tori. No. You can't digest the food. Your stomach hurt. You ain't got no, you ain't got, how, how you ain't got no money on your books, Tory Lanes? You worth over $5 million. You got plenty of money. Boy, you don't think I seen that Rolls Royce? You pulled up in when you came to court. I seen that. Your daddy might got it now, but I'm just saying, I know you got money. Why ain't no money on your books? I appreciate you. Yeah, see, yeah, man, yeah, these, yeah. Yeah, oh, these right here? No, these, no, these the Feather K Michael brand right here. Now, where I get these from? Tori, you can't get these in there. Now, I got these right here. This is a guy that got, well, he's a black guy. He got his own sun, sunglass brand. Yeah, he sell his own glasses. And he reached out to me on social media. And he gave me a, I got a sponsorship deal. That's why you only seeing me wear these glasses right here. Can you get some of these? Well, Next month, everybody will be able to go online and get the Jonathan Stewart Forever K. Michaels Black Edition with the little missing part right there. Everybody, everybody, I mean, all everybody will be able to get these glasses. But I don't think you're going to be able to get these glasses. Mm-mm, not where you at, Tory Lane. You, you shouldn't even be worrying about looking cool. No. So did, did they, what, what did they, what exactly did they give you since you've been in there? Nothing. Come on, man. They got to give you something to brush your teeth. They had to. What? You've been using the same face towel that you used to bathe with. You've been having to... You got to use that face towel so you put in toothbrush. You putting toothpaste on a towel, brushing your teeth with it? Oh, man, life is totally different for you and here, Tori. Man. God. You ain't got but that one towel. So it's hard for you to wash your face with that same towel with that toothpaste on it. You ain't washed your face in three days. How you washing your face? You gotta use the end of a sock, your sock. And they only, they gave you two pair of socks. And let me get this right. You gotta use a face towel. You gotta put toothpaste on a face towel to brush your teeth. And you gotta use the end of one of your socks to wash your face with. Oh man, Tori, that's going bad. Yeah, I, your stomach bloated. I seen that. Because, I mean, you used to walk around with a six-pack. It looked like you got a little pooch, a little fupa right there in the front. What's wrong with your stomach? You can't digest the food. It's, man. So what they feeding you in here? I know you ain't getting no crab legs. They gave you a piece of hard cornbread, some peas. 
dead hair in the peas. Dried up meatloaf. Three grapes. What they giving you to drink in here? South Peter water. They so they still serving the inmate South Peter water. Yeah, I know what South Peter water. They put that South Peter in that water, so it keep y'all from getting horny in here. Keep y'all from getting hard in here, cause ain't nothing but a bunch of men. And when y'all been, I'm just saying. Hey man, say I know, I know you ain't gonna play like that, but I'm just saying, man, I didn't know they still. They give y'all South Peter salt and South Peter pepper, so they want y'all numb. They don't want, they don't want. Oh, man, they don't want y'all to have no stimulation, nowhere from the waist down. Man, you shouldn't even be thinking about how long it's been since you done touched a woman. Them days over for you. You ain't got to worry about touching. Say what? Hey, man, if you're going to file your appeal, go and file your appeal. But I'm telling you right now. Man, that phone conversation you made when you was in jail and they was at the hospital, man, it's just incrim Yeah, you incriminated yourself, man. Mm-hmm. Y'all see, we just talked about your stomach a while ago. You, yeah, you bloated, what you, yeah, you probably had to, I don't know what you gonna drink. It ain't nothing you can take. Can I put $5 on your books? Well, yeah, Tori, hey, I ain't got no problem with putting $5 on your books. Uh, I understand, you know, you ain't out there. You ain't killed nobody. You know, you whatever happened, you know, you you already been judged. I ain't going to kick you away. What is it that you can buy with $5? You know, yeah, I come closer. You, you don't want nobody to know. Yeah. And this is what's going to help your stomach go down. It's going to clean your insides out. What you need? Let me. Tori, you. So they sell suppositories in here. Oh, it's a kit. You get two suppository, a honey bun. And three pieces of chewing gum. Wonder why they put them together. Oh, it's called a prison survival kit. Okay, the, the bubble gum, the honey bun, and the suppositories. You don't understand why they put it together as a kit needle? Well, I don't know, neither, Tori. Well, look, man, I got five, I, I got some money on me. So I'm going to go and put a hunt. I don't think you can't get no... 300 is the limit you can get a month. Okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put $100 on your books. Now, when I come back down here and see you again, I don't want you to be walking around with your stomach sticking all out in front of you, Tory Lanes. Yeah, I... Ooh, boy, but them suppositories going to burn. Can you imagine when you put them suppositories... Oh, yeah, you don't want to talk about it. Yeah, that's just... Ugh, yeah, they ain't, ain't two men ain't got no business talking about suppositories. Yeah, we yeah, we ain't, yeah, okay. Yeah, you right. Y'all finna go do it right now. I finna go down there and they, they got a thing down there where I can swipe my car and then it go right in your account. Yeah, I'ma tell you, I'm, I got you, man. I, Tori, I know your stomach hurting. I finna go do it right now, man. I, I got, man, you gonna get your suppositories tonight. And you're going to be able to clean your guts out. Yeah, look at you, man. You acting like Craig Daddy on Friday. You acting like John Weatherspoon. Like you got them bad guts. Like your hems is. Your hemorrhoids done flared up. Man, have you. No, I ain't. <laughs> I 
I ain't, I ain't saying you've been doing nothing. I'm just saying you say you need suppository. Now you say your hemorrhoids been flat. I'm just making sure there ain't nobody done touched you down there. Since you've been down. <laughs> All right, man. Yeah, I'm finna go put this on your books. Yeah, I'm gonna come back and see you again, man. Yeah. All right. I got you. All right, man. Yeah, you be safe. <laughs> hemorrhoids, boy.